Hello everyone, how are you? In this tutorial, I'm going to show to you how to apply conditional formatting in Excel to highlight cells in the joining date column that fall between two specific dates. This feature known as between dates conditional formatting can be very useful for tracking enters within a particular date range. Okay, let's start. First of all, open the Excel file that contains your data. Make sure you have a column name joining date with the dates you want to format. Then select joining date this column full range. Now navigate to the home tab on the ribbon. In the styles groups, click on the conditional formatting. From the drop down menu, select new rule and you can see a dialog box. In the new format rule dialog box, select use a formula to determine which cells to format. In this format values where is the formula is true field, enter the following formula. Here type equal a and d and bracket open this first cell joining date first cell and remove row dollar sign greater than equal then type date function okay now here type our years our years is 2024 then type comma then month our month is 01 and then type comma and then date our date is 10 now bracket close then again select this joining date first date and remove row dollar sign then less than equal again type date function bracket open type your years and type month i also type 01 this month and type days 31 this days okay now bracket close two time because here we are use two function okay now give the formatting so in this purpose click this format this tool and go to this fill now select any color also you can change font color fill color and other formatting this format cells this dialog box this options okay when you select your requirement format then click ok and again click ok now you can see here your specific date automatically tracking a color for example you type any date I will type 11 01 2024 you can see this formatting automatically tracking you have successfully applied conditional formatting in excel to highlight cell base on a date range in the joining date column this feature can help you easily identify and manage specific date points within your sheet if you found this tutorial helpful, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more Excel tips and tricks. Thanks for watching.